Hello, it's Adrian. How are you today? And uh, welcome to Glomus. And I uh, do Glomus during the holidays, and um, it's a lot of fun, but we don't do it every single day. Right now, I'm posting every single day, but I won't be during all of December, but I will be doing some of the end of the year videos. Um, favorites, fails, uh, favorite drugstore. I'm actually going to in include some skincare this year. And so I thought I'd just go ahead and do a whole video introducing it. And yep, yeah, we're about a week into December and I'm just now announcing it. So guess what? I am a little bit behind right now. Yep, yeah, that's the truth. Um, but I thought we'd go ahead and get started and I'd show you what I'm wearing today. Uh, right now I have the Oma by Sharon C. This is the one that you can get. Um, I think, I'm not sure if they're actually still in production right now. Um, there's been a little bit of controversy as far as their website. and um, But I think you can probably still get it through Alta right now and so I have the T2 on. In fact, um, it would be probably be a better idea to go ahead and get it through Alta if you want to go ahead and order or replace some OMA uh, products because like I said, I'm not sure exactly what's going on on their website right now. And uh, let's see, what else do I have on here? I do have the Incognito, and this is uh, the concealer that I have on right now. I did go ahead and start off today with the Elf Halo Glow, and this is the Rose You Slay color, and I think it turned out really pretty. Um, it's definitely more of what I would consider a coral rather than a rose. And just to go ahead and do a swatch of it right there. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. It definitely has, anyway, to me it looks like it's running more coral than it's running rose. So um, that's also what I have on the cheeks today. And let's see if we can, yeah. Maybe we should just add a little bit more in and see. These are very, very me metallic. Um, they are meant to be dupes for uh, the Charlotte Tilbury formula. And so they do run like a metallic eyeshadow, a liquid metallic eyeshadow. So, um, yeah, there we go. Now we're back again. And as far as what I have on for the actual glow today, I do have the ColourPop uh, Spotlight. And this is one of the ones that you can get over at Target. So that's what I have on there. I was really impressed by the way the the eye look came out today because I wasn't going for anything that would end up uh, being it, it, it's almost reading gray and it's really more of a really dark um, oh, what's the name of that color ah, it's uh, escaping my mind right now and um, teal so this is actually more of a really dark teal and it's actually coming out as kind of a gray and we'll get to that in just one second here um i did go ahead and use the beauty pie this is their triple beauty perfect glowy powder because we are all about the glowy around here and um yeah so it's and we're also about seeing if it'll blow out the camera because it does every once in a while there'll just be too much stuff going on and the camera will go no can't deal with it can't deal with it but it looks like it's doing a okay right now i do have the essence thick and wow on in caramel blonde and that's what i have in my brows and um this it's a really i like the formula the brush is a little bit large this is kind of what the brush looks like. So it looks like a regular spoolie, basically. And um, with it being that large, you do have to clean up a little bit. Um, but 
I'm liking the formula and it has a lot of pigment to it. And as I'm getting older, that's something that I'm kind of finding is that, yeah, especially with brow products, I need a little bit more pigment than what I did. Um, do you have the lippy pencil on from, um, let's see, from ColourPop and this one is in Good and Plenty which is a really, really pretty shade. And I did pick up a whole bunch of their lippy pencils just because they stay and they aren't sort of trying to run around your, you know, and give you that sort of a clown looking thing going on, which is what happens, yeah, sometimes with some of the really, uh, the really, liquid sheer ones will sometimes do that but you don't see it as much when a regular lipstick sort of does that clown thing then you really notice it but that's probably another video so we'll come back to that later and then as far as what i have on the eyes it surprised me so much and i really like um i got the jewels and gem from odin's eye and so, yeah, really pretty packaging. They always do amazing on the packaging. And I hadn't really tried them until Black Friday when I brought up, when I got my first palette. And I went back and made another order because, yeah, it's a beautiful formula. This is the way that the palette looks. And um, this was one of their big releases of the year. I actually ended up using this shade which is, um, it is a teal shade. And then um, I did a little bit of the blue in the outer corner. And I was thinking, I was really worried about it going way too dark. And um, what I did was I used this beautiful pink shade on the inner corner. And I went ahead and used this shade down here, which is another uh, topper shade right on the lid itself and it's just there is so much glimmer in this formula and i'm pretty sure it's micro uh, micro glitter in there but it's gorgeous and so the way that this um i like turned out i'm just been there's so much shimmer and glimmer in it it's just really really pretty and um I did go ahead and use the blue as my eyeliner under the eye as well. And this way that the eye look came out. So that's the way that that came out. And it came out um, just with enough glimmer that it went ahead and took the darkness of the shadow down. And I really like it. I've been wearing it. This is later in the day for me. So I've been wearing it all day long. I haven't had to touch up it at all. And it's just been really pretty. So um, yeah, I have really found in the last month that I really like their formula. And um, I'm so glad that I've had a chance to try it here. So this is the Jewels and Gems. And I'll be doing more looks with these as well. And again, it's a brand new palette to me. It has been out for a while. I think it's been out for, what is about six months now? And they come with all the packaging from Odin's eyes. It's just really, really pretty. So um, this is the palette that I have on today. And I just wanted to let you know about Glomis and how I'll be doing some videos primarily geared toward the glow and um that that's sort of the holiday that we do around here and i hope that you have a great day and i'll see you later bye